Hi guys, I'm back with my nail fantasy and I'm happy that you are here as well. Let's have fun with our nails. In this video I show you the second part of my Madame Glam review and swatches and we are looking today at the glitter virgin colada from the smoothie gel collection and a holographic chrome powder which is called a dream come through. If you want to see how they look on my nails, then stay tuned. Catherine from Madame Glam has sent me some nice nail art products, some nice polishes again. Thank you so much, Catherine. And in the last video, we looked at these two. We did swatches on my natural nails. So if you haven't seen that one, I will link it at the end and you can check that out. This one is a chameleon gel color changing polish. The name is Grey Day. And this one is a regular gel polish and it's called Kind of Wonderful. It's a really pretty bluish purplish color perfect for spring and today we're gonna look at this gel glitter polish it's from their smoothie gel collection and this one is called virgin colada we have here in the bottle cap a little swatch already and you can see it consists of small gold glitter flakes and then some larger round glitters in dark and light purple really pretty i'm gonna open the bottle so you can see how that one looks and look how much glitter is in here it sparkles really really pretty it has a light yellowish base so we will see how it looks on different colors and the last one that we will see today the last last product i got for you is this holographic chrome powder and you can already see the rainbow going on in here look how pretty that looks and this one is called a dream come true the links to all these products i will put in the video description below also with a 30 percent discount code that you can use however you have to use a certain link for that that's also in the description below so please check out the video description and if you heard that clack that was a cat as always they have have to run around when I film videos. <laughs> anyway, everything is in the video description, so please check that out. Also, for the detailed information on how to apply these polishes, but you're gonna see that also now on my natural nails. I will start with black and white, and then we have the Some Kind of Wonderful and the Grey Day as base colors so you can see how the glitter virgin colada looks on different colors and for the chrome powder it's also recommended to use it with gels so i have again a black a white base usually these powders especially the holographic ones the effect is best on black backgrounds but we will see how they look on white some kind of wonderful and the gray day today and you are supposed to apply of course a base coat then one or two coats of your color then you use a no wipe top coat gel top coat and then you apply the powder with these eyeshadow applicators they give you two of those afterwards you put on again a no wipe gel top coat and that's it you can also use these powders on regular polishes. You have seen me do this in lots of videos. And I usually use Orly Bonder to get a little sticky surface on my base color. And afterwards, when you have applied the powder, you have to use a water-based top coat. This works as well. We're gonna get started now applying the glitter and the chrome powder. As always, I will speed up the video. So sit back, relax and enjoy. And we'll see you afterwards with my finished nails and we'll see how these look.
Guys, I'm back and I hope you're wearing sunglasses because I'm blinding you here with these gorgeous chrome polo mirror nails. It's awesome. A dream come true. That's really the perfect name for this powder. Look how gorgeous that is. And it worked perfectly. First I thought I will have some minor specks remaining from the base, but you just really have to rub it in with the applicator. You don't need too much of the powder and you really rub it in and then you have this awesome holographic effect here. Look at that linear hollow. It's, I mean, what do you think? I think I have never seen a powder that had this kind of great effect. We have here the black base. This was the white base. You can see a difference. It's not that big a difference, but you can see it. This is the blue base, the kind of wonderful. I like that one best personally. And then here we have the color changing, which is the gray day. Of course, the color changing will not work now with the chrome polish with the chrome powder, sorry, on top of the nails. Look at that. This is just awesome. On the other side, I have the Virgin Colada and I already mentioned it. The base, the glitter base of this polish is a little yellow tint, a little, has a yellow power up has a yellowish tint to it. So you can see that on the black here that you have this yellow tinted glitter base on the white as well but not as prominent as on the black then we have the kind of wonderful again this is my favorite base for this glitter and the gray day which is also really nice this glitter makes this gray polish pop i have done two nail arts for these two polishes with the glitter and some stamping included and i will pop that at the end so you can check that out i like this for summer for spring it's a perfect glitter topper. I have put on two coats and also a no wipe top coat on that. With the first coat I did not get too many of the bigger glitters but that was fine. With the second coat it's enough glitter but if that's not enough for you you can even add a third coat if you like that. What do you think? Really like these products. Thanks again to Catherine from Madam Glam for letting me review those for you. And that was it for today, guys. If you have any further questions or comments, just leave them in the comments box below. If you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up and I would be happy if you subscribe to my channel. There will be a bubble with my picture at the end. Just click on that, doesn't cost you anything and you will not miss any of my future videos. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all a wonderful time wherever you are and ta-ta till next time.